harder than it seems It's not letting go of me What's there to be afraid of? Time to give it all I'm made of It's all or nothing on the beginning of the end I'm not the prey, I'm the hunter And I will defend it's Hi there, the welcome to Dear Cyber Sue. Today I want to do a video mainly for millennials because there's a lot of people out there that are lost with what to do. You have so much uh, technology at your fingertips that it's overwhelming on what's right, what's wrong, how do you live life. And the funny thing is, even though you have all this help at your fingertips, sometimes there's not enough mentors in your life to really guide you in the direction you need to be guided. Today's topic is, beauty is all about attitude. So. Yes, I understand that there's some great things available. Trust me, it's very tempting for me too, especially being my age, to want to look younger, to want to be the best I can be in a physical sense. Because there's nothing worse when you get older than seeing the changes that transpire. We have 10 good years where we're really happy with our physical side, and that's probably between uh, maybe 18 to 28. And then we start thinking about all the stuff we want to do to change ourselves. Beauty really truly is about who you are as a person, how you come across, how sweet you are to other people, how, how loving you are. There's so much competitive shit going on right now that's really irritating me, that's confusing a lot of young people. It's becoming so transparent about how we have to look and how we have to you know, act about a certain way. And it's not a good thing to be because you want to be who you are. You don't want to have to fit into a stereotype. You want to be able to, to be yourself without sitting there going, oh my God, people are going to judge me. Or, or I'm looking at other women who are better looking than me. They've had more work done on themselves. And the sad part is a lot of these women are in their early 20s. They're already doing everything they can to enhance their looks. But I'm telling you right now, the majority of guys, ladies, really like natural women. They like women who are confident in themselves, who have, you know, their work, their work in progress, of course, about you know, trying to find who they are and work their way through their career and their school and all the stuff that they're trying to do. But beauty is not about Botox and fillers and lip enhancement on a continual basis. Wouldn't it be better to put energy into your attitude and being a great person that's fun to be around, that maybe helps other people, that's supportive, that's loyal, that's a really good friend? But I'm finding what's happening right now as an older woman is I'm meeting some great millennials that chat to me about a lot of things and I'm really grateful for that because I really like to be able to help them with just some view, different viewpoints. I'm not saying I know exactly what I'm talking about, but I have lived a very full life. So I do get stuff and I'm also very involved in social media. So I understand the pressures that go with a lot of things out there. So what I'm trying to put out there right now is just if you can work on yourself, and how you project yourself and how people view you as a, an everyday person before all the other things that are added to what you're trying to do to yourself. That's the real you. That's the person that people want to meet. That's the person that's going to get you the job. And that's the person that's going to keep your friends coming back. You don't want to be one of the housewives on TV that are fighting with each other. There's competitiveness going on. There's all sorts of stuff that shouldn't be taught to younger people. But that's what you're seeing. That's what you're hearing. And that's why you're confused. But I want you to really understand that the person you truly want to be is the one that's in here. And little bits of stuff you want to do on the outside. I'm not saying you're not going to do that and it's not okay to do that once in a while. But if you're 20 years old and you're already starting all this stuff, you got to work on the other stuff first because that's who's going to be, people are going to be attracted to that person, not the person that's all a facade. So hear me, okay? Please hear me. 
that beauty really is all about attitude. And if you're a good person, you're not a doormat. I'm not telling you to kiss ass to everybody, but you're a good person and you're loyal and you're, you're sweet and you're, you're kind to everybody that you meet. You're going to always have a nice flowing life because you're going to attract great things towards you. Anyway. Okay. Something to think about there. Um, let me know what you think. And, um, I'm here for you anytime you have any questions for me and I get it. I get how hard it is being this age in the millennial millennial stage of life. It's really, really difficult, but don't use it as an excuse not to be the best person you can be because every year, whether you're 30, 40, 50, whatever, has something you have to learn. It's not just millennials who have to learn stuff. I'm still learning. Look how old I am. Anyway, thanks so much everyone for tuning into Dear Cyber Suit. Please subscribe and like the video and uh, leave your comments below.